Happy birthday, Father Ed. It's a great pleasure to extend best wishes on your hundredth from Rafe and Marlena. You are always an inspiration and a great faithful witness, and we enjoyed our time together in Tacoma. Happy birthday. Are we going to sing? Well, we won't sing. We'll save you that. But happy, <laughs> happy birthday, birthday, happy hundredth, and, and we think of you often. Many blessings. Happy birthday, Father Ed. Please know we're all thinking about you, even if we can't get together this year. Many, many blessings, and we love you. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Father Ed! Winnie, say happy birthday. <laughs> happy birthday. Happy birthday, birthday Father, Father Ed. Ed. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Father Ed. Ed. Father Ed, from one McGregor to another, I'd like to wish you a happy 100th birthday. And now I'll sing happy birthday to you. Just kidding. Hello from the Galb House. We're here to wish the Reverend Canon Edward Sterling a wonderful, blessed 100th birthday. A hundred years? Yep. But he looks so young. He's such a blessing to us all. <laughs> happy birthday! Happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday from New Hampshire. Father Ed, you are a blessing to so many. I want to thank you for your friendship, your mentorship, and your guidance throughout my ministry and before I was ordained. You are always going to be a part of my family. As I've told you before, you have been absorbed into the Schnack Alberto family, and we love you. Happy birthday. Hi, Father Ed. Stan and Gretchen here from Orcas Island, wishing you a very, very happy and memorable 100th birthday. Yeah, we miss you and we love you. And we hope you have a wonderful day. And we can't wait until we can get down to Tacoma and see you again. Meantime, we send you virtual hugs. And happy, happy, happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. Happy 100th birthday, Father Sterling. Thanks for the cow. Happy birthday, Father Ed from Maxwell over in Camp Lejeune, North Carolina. Love you lots, and I hope your 100th birthday is awesome. Happy birthday, Father Ed. We love you. Congratulations. Hi, Ed. This is Margo. Just wishing you a happy, happy 100th birthday. I'm just so blessed that you're a part of my life. Happy birthday, Father Ed. From the gas bars. Happy, happy birthday, birthday, Father Ed. From the McDuals. Happy birthday, Father Ed. I hope this day is as special as you are and that you get every blessing that you deserve. You are so much a part of our lives. Thank you for being with us. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Father, Father Ed. Ed. We love you. Happy birthday, Father Ed. A hundred. That's awesome. Dave and Sue. Happy birthday, Father Ed. Happy birthday. We love you. We miss you very much. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Father Ed. We love you. Happy birthday, Father Ed. Hi, Father Ed. Happy birthday. It's Nikki Weeks. I'm honored to be able to join with the rest of St. Andrews in wishing you a very happy birthday on this, your 100th birthday. You've lived quite a life. You've been a faithful servant of God throughout. And um, we all wish the best for you. Looking forward to when we can come back together and enjoy some more of your chili, perhaps. But no obligation there. Happy, happy birthday. All the way from Oregon, happy birthday to you, Father Ed. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday, Father Ed, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Ed. Congratulations on becoming a centenarian. You are beloved in this community. You're a wonderful addition to our family. Happy birthday. God bless. Hey, to you. Wish
we're so glad you're alive. You're a gift from the earth. Bless the day of your birth. Bless the day of your birth. Happy birthday, Father Ed. Happy birthday, birthday, Father Ed! Happy birthday, Father Ed. We uh, are so happy to be part of this celebration of you turning 100. It just does not seem possible. We've been <clears throat> members at St. Andrews for 27 years, and you have been there for all the important events of our life. And you have just become such a inspiration to us and such an important part of our life at St. Andrews. I love going to Friday lunch with you and hope to do it for several more years and we appreciate the work that you do with the members of St. Andrews and we you're an inspiration to everybody and thank you so much. Definitely a legacy of love Father Ed. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy Centennial, Father Ed. It's been an honor and a pleasure to know you. You are a very special man, and we love you very much. Happy birthday, darling. Happy birthday, Father Ed. You have accomplished a lot in the past hundred years. We love you. Happy 100th birthday, Father Ed. We hope you have a good day for it. We uh, thank you for all the things you've done for us and our family, especially taking the time to visit and, and comfort Michael when he was in the hospital after breaking his leg. Hopefully next year we'll be able to spend your 101st birthday in person with you. Happy ha birthday. Happy birthday. Hi, Father Ed. Happy birthday for your first 100 years. This is the sister act, Rita and Maria Fleischman. Take it away, Maria. Hi, Father Ed. Happy birthday. Happy 100th birthday. We love you. We're proud of you. And be safe and have a wonderful year. Hi, Father Ed. This is Jesse Smith wishing you a happy birthday from Claremont, California. I hope you have an amazing day and another wonderful year ahead. You are a blessing to us all. And I'm lucky that our paths crossed while I was at St. Andrews. I always think of you when I use my daily office book that you gave me, and of course, the hood that we share from Seminary of the Southwest. Thank you for being born, for spending an amazing amount of love on everyone that you have met over these last 100 years. Much love to you, Father Ed. Happy birthday, Father Ed. We are so grateful and thankful for your ministry and the love you show to us all. Amen. Greetings, St. Andrews Tacoma. I hear that you all are having a big celebration today, quite a do, and I'm glad to hear it especially when I found out it's to honor the Reverend Canon Ed Sterling, who is going to three digits today. Amazing. I always hoped that I would see this, and more importantly, that you would, Ed. And I congratulate you on many achievements you've made, but this is a big one, especially in the eras we just lived through, the days we just lived through, to make it to 100. Congratulations. And where this church is so fortunate and blessed is that for those hundred years you've given so openly, lovingly, and completely to it. I cannot thank you enough. I want to say happy birthday, and I want to tell uh, those that are watching that uh, some of you have told this story before, but I knew Ed Sterling long before I knew Olympia and knew most any of you because he used to sit sometimes on the back row at St. James Episcopal Church in Austin, Texas, because his son lived there. And so he would visit there pretty often. I got to know him. In fact, I knew him well enough. I believe I was at St. Andrews Tacoma during the walkabouts 14 years ago, and he came walking up to me, and I immediately blurted out, 
hey, what are you doing here? And he said, I belong here. I live here. And it was so great to see a familiar face. He's always been so good to me. And Ed, I just cannot thank you enough for everything that you do, for the gentle spirit that you are, but more than that, for the way you serve the church and the people of the church. And that includes me. You've been a great uh, blessing to me, a great mentor to me. And I just congratulate you on 100 years. I wish I could be there in person with you, but please know that you are in my prayers and you are also something that somebody that I give great gratitude for to be in my life. So happy birthday and St. Andrews, please do it up big as you can. He certainly deserves it. Happy birthday, Ed, and thank you, Martin, and all there.